so we're gonna continue on with dying light 2 i will show you guys what i did in the previous episode uh unfortunately i didn't do it as a as an actual episode i was just kind of playing the game so i'll be right back so for what I did in that one episode, uh, Kara got caught by the assholes by the ambush. Uh, we ended up doing that, which was really fun. Uh, I had to choose between helping Sophie and Aider. I ended up helping Aider because Sophie's a fucking asshole. And uh, yeah, her brother's a piece of shit too. Had to stop two idiots from blowing up the water supply, which is a lot of fun. And I found Luca's uh, tattoo in Barney's place. And now Barney and Sophie are saying that, I, that they're being... Uh, framed so that's what happened uh, i'll show a little bit here and there but that's pretty much it nothing too crazy happened um, aside from lucas's tattoo like that one was really wild so uh yeah let's just go right into the video so that being out of the way uh you guys already know what's gonna happen we sided with the uh pk for one of the things and the ambush happened we took over a place i should have showed you but just in case so <clears throat> oh not only that uh, apparently we found the the tattoo the skin tattoo and the people in the bazaar are saying that they're getting framed i don't care because the people from the bazaar are fucking horrible like the brother did cocaine bro like he was like and then he was like it's up to you. like bro i hate this. i hate this dude like legitimately want to kill him this is madness sophie the peacekeepers have more weapons men they will crush us like worms ator may have more men but we have the home field advantage home field advantage you're crazy i forbid it while I lead the bazaar, no one will attack the peacekeepers. You no longer lead the bazaar. What? You're no leader, Carl. Never were. We lost people because of you. <clears throat> Crystals. You almost got yourself killed. My mother wanted a free bazaar, not slaves serving the peacekeepers. I want to restore peace here. You can help me with this, or leave. Roger, Humphrey, arrest them. What are you doing? They want to betray the bazaar! Roger! You have no power anymore, Carl. You want to be like your mother? You'll have blood on your hands, Sophie! A lot of blood! Carl is right. We don't stand a chance in open battle. Sophie? <clears throat> what the- Therefore, we're gonna weaken them first. What do you mean? We'll cut off their main source of electricity. Without UV lamps, Aidor <clears throat> can't defend his base. They will be driven from the metro tunnels and cut off from the armory. How does all this get me to the central loop? Once Aidor is weakened, he will retreat for reinforcements. Then you can make it to the central loop, Aiden. But first, we have to blow up the windmill. And fast, before Aidor gets wind of what we're planning. Barney, gather our people. Be ready. Roger and Humphrey, go to the armory. Provide weapons to anyone <coughs> capable of fighting. And you, Aiden, go to Alberto and Vincenzo. They'll walk you through the plan. Okay. Can't Community wait. Community and freedom, Aiden. Together, we will I win. I can't wait until I kill these siblings. Because best believe, I'm at least killing the fucking brother. I, I am going to murder the shit out of him. And you guys have no idea how happy that's gonna make me because i fucking hate this dude first let's a teenager we fucking die today. and not like like it he he he, he had his fucking intestines hey, out Alberto, <clears throat> this new armor of yours is flimsy more fit for a beetle than people yeah way too thin felix time Peter shows a great protection. This is top craftsmanship made from the finest quality materials. Built from. Ah. Ah. Uh oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out, he's gonna blow. <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. <clears throat> That's why they're lighter and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. I'd let them die. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Nah. 
as for you. Those two oafs took the last titanium vests. No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Carl agreed? Carl agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. <coughs> Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. But first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hmm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you... Have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, <coughs> the past chemical fallout and to, uh, uh, what's it called? The central loop. The central loop, right. How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it? The PKs won't last another night in Old Villador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So. I'm fine. Okay. Go to the. Let me know once you get there. That Being impatient. The like, PK legitimately. Like, I want to play the game. There's Hakon. Back then, everyone must. Alberto, I have your fertilizer. It's Vincenzo. Vincenzo? I, I can barely hear you. The PKs. They raided my place. I can't talk. The traitor. He sold us all out. Hayden, Dad went ahead to the windmill. Meet him there. I'll meet you when I can. Make sure that fertilizer gets to my dad. I don't want Vic okay, Vincenzo to die. Just come quick. Like, he, he seems like a good person. I don't want him to die. They're I mean, still after me. I'm pinned down, Hayden. Another patrol. You have to do it without me. Join my dad. I'll be on the radio the whole time. Me and your dad? You think that's a good idea? We have no choice, Aiden. Like I okay, like I'm not a plan means everything to my dad. I don't know if you noticed, but dad's kind of awkward and unappreciated. This is a chance to show Carl, Sophie, everyone at the bazaar that they were wrong. What dad's made of, what he can do. He'll be the hero of the bazaar after this one. He always wanted to do something big. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. I'll stay with you on the radio. Hello? Vincenzo? Hello? Vincenzo, I... I can't hear you. What? What do I have to do? I brought the fertilizer. You sure you got this? Of course I'm sure. And if I don't know something, I can ask Vincenzo. Ah, the windmill's causing too much interference. <coughs> it doesn't work. Ah. Then I'll figure it out Watch myself. explode in his face. It's as easy as I. And you're certain? He explained everything to me. Relax. A little kooky, we'll old man. Do... Me and you will do. <laughs> no reason we won't do just. And Fine. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. You're up. Take the charges and secure them to the spots Vincenzo marked for us. Planting bombs. Oh, what could go wrong? Easy as pie, right? Yes, precisely. Oh, I 
have three. Like I said, easy as pie. Okay. I mean, I'm not gonna say no. <laughs> All right, so we'll do we'll do this one because I want to get up to three hundred. <sighs> Hear that? Like, sound like a monster almost. Hurry up, Adam. Oh, don't talk we to me. To see the <sighs> so like, to the end. can I not like not tell them? It doesn't tell me anything. <clears throat> Do I like actually climb up there? Whatever you intruder! Intruder! Out of here. Oh, I could have gone through Stop. the water. You're just letting me plant bombs. <laughs> this is so funny to me. <laughs> it's like these is really just letting me do this. Place. What the fuck was that? Time for the fireworks. <clears throat> Would you like the honors? Uh, I know how much this means to you. isn't triggering must be interference from the wind uh, it doesn't look like it did much the windmill's still standing hey, look the rotor's still spinning Vincenzo's calculations they must be off uh, I'm expecting this dude to get shot in the face right now it's fixed in a flash. Gotta see this through. What are you doing? An Making armed a bomb. bomb? Before the PKs get here. Giving you an armed... Um, uh, armed... We can't rely on radio detonation. Not with all the interference. What now? This one is guaranteed to blow up the whole windmill. All right, how much time do I have? Let me count. Hmm? It'll blow any second. Run! But where am I supposed to put it? Where? You have to go back. And? And plant it on... Uh, place it on... Put 
put it on the on the rock to the very top the fucking Are you serious the bomb's ticking this motherfucker how much time do i have only oh, let it lets me it lets me know oh well. at least this okay i'm okay this is cool then gives me a shortcut I, I kind of want to side with the PKs because you know they don't kill teenagers and fucking do cocaine. Spare too. Land in the water. did it i think i think we're good we're good guys we're good we did it man it's cold hello hey alberto i'm coming you sons of bitches what have you done to him ready to die quick before I fucking help you considering I might have to fight again. All right. Bravo. My boy. No. That's what I call Oh. <laughs> I got my I like the Alberto. Boom. I mean, he was kind of fucked in the head, but I mean, that doesn't mean you, he has to die. You, you got them pretty good. Huh? And we, we got him good. Without you, the windmill would still be standing. Almost like the fireworks in 90... Uh, 90... Uh, even... Ah, oh, man. I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Aiden. I'm not that adult. <sighs> Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <laughs> so fucked up. Tell everyone 
We pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <coughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <coughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See? His, his old man's, huh? Not a cook or a, or a failure anymore. <laughs> Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him. That... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. I'll tell him for you. I promise. Up, dude. More. Hey, Aiden. Nice fireworks show you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle stand. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Fuck, I have to choose. Are you sure? <sighs> I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakan. I promised. A night fucking errand. Hurry. Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive. Thank <laughs> you. 